Fresh emergency allotments are ending tomorrow. KPBS reporter Melissa May visited a food distribution specifically for seniors that is set up to help those on a fixed income still put food on the table. Robin Moreno is a South Bay resident who is on a fixed income and was getting the CalFresh emergency allotment of $281 a month. But now that's coming to an end. If you're a senior, your Social Security income doesn't go up when inflation goes up. They have the same amount to live on. Our rents are crazy expensive here in California and especially in San Diego. Food prices are high, gas prices are high, and so it's services like the food banks, food distributions that really wrap around those seniors. Shelly Parks is with the San Diego Food Bank, which recently served about 2,000 seniors in Chula Vista with boxes of food. The box is about 40 pounds. It contains a lot of staple items, canned goods, dry goods to get them through the month. Many seniors are struggling to survive even with CalFresh benefits. That's a tough choice that a lot of people have to make. Do you fill your prescription or do you eat for the day? Some seniors cutting prescription pills in half against doctor's orders, but just to make that prescription last a little bit longer, especially if they have something high cost that isn't covered by their Medi-Cal. Park says even though the extra benefits end on February 28th, people won't feel the pinch right away. We expect to see the, the real surge in need in April because people are getting that money in their EBT card, able to spend it at the grocery store through March. But come April, we know that that money's not going to be there. The San Diego Food Bank hosts 74 food distributions for seniors every month. You can find their locations and the food bank's other food distributions at sandiegofoodbank.org slash get help. Melissa May, KPBS News.